look, I am spraying my hair white with this Party City White Hairspray, and one can only spray the top section of my hair. It takes a lot to get your hair really, really white, so keep that in mind when you're buying spray, because you might have to buy a lot. And then I'm just using some of these fur strips. I got them at Joann's, and I made a headband out of one and a top for my dress with the other. And now with some pink and blue ribbon, I'm going to add some color to my frostbitten hair. So just putting a ribbon on a bobby pin, just go ahead and stick it into the underneath section of your hair. And they can be in random colors, it doesn't have to be necessarily blue pink, blue pink, you can mix it up. And I am wearing purple contacts to match Abby's eyes, but if you do not wear contacts or do not feel comfortable, go ahead and skip this step. And now taking this very simple and cheap white makeup from Party City, I am painting my entire face white, as well as around my neck and my chest, just any place that is going to show through my dress. And now to give my skin that bluish icy sparkle, I'm taking a light blue eyeshadow and just covering my entire face, neck, and chest with this color. And using a very dark blue, we're going to contour our face. So I always start at below my cheekbones to make this really nice and dark so you have really good contrast on your face. And because we don't want our forehead blending in with our hair, go ahead and use this dark color all along your hairline. And don't forget to add some dark blue on your neck and chest as well so it all matches. And now for Abby's eye makeup. So I'm going to start off with this really light purple and I'm going to apply this all over my lid. From the inner corner all the way out to the side. And just to add a little bit more dimension, I'm adding a pearly light pink on the inner corners. And I'm just using what eyeshadow is left on my brush and dragging this down below my eye. Using the light pink as a highlight, we are going to swoop this all over the top part of our eye. And then taking a very hot pink, we're going to kind of outline that light pink color. So using a flat brush, just go ahead and drag this hot pink all over the edge of that light pink. And now for that monster high double eyelid crease, I'm using a purple makeup pencil and just drawing it on where the two colors meet above my eyelid. And using that same dark purple, I'm going to fill in my eyebrows. And you rock those crazy purple eyebrows. And now using a black liquid liner, go ahead and give yourself a nice cat eye eyeliner. And now taking a black pencil, feel free to line your waterline. But if your eyes are really sensitive, go ahead and skip this. And now for Abby's freckles, which kind of remind me of snowflakes. So taking a white makeup pencil, go ahead and just dot little white dots all over your forehead and under your eyes. Concentrate them near your hairline and then fade them out. Go ahead and add some thick and dramatic lashes to top off this look. Now taking some white glitter, we are going to sparkle like freshly fallen snow. So go ahead and add this glitter below your eyes and on your forehead. So pretty much just where the freckles are that we placed. And I'm just going to add a whole bunch more like on the bridge of my nose as well as down my jawline. And don't forget your shoulders and your chest. Pretty much I'm making my skin sparkle like snow. Now I don't know about you, but I do not have fangs. So we're going to go ahead and paint on some fake ones with white eyeliner. Actually, Jackie Laura has fangs. Abby more has tusks that point upwards. So we're going to actually draw our tusks on our top lip pointing up. And now taking a hot pink makeup pencil, we're going to be very careful not to touch our fangs. We're going to outline our lips with this as well as just fill them in. Top off your lips with a hot pink lip gloss and we are ready to go. Don't be different, be like them instead. They can't keep us down cause we're monster hybrids. The clock is striking. Alright, so thank you so much for joining me for this Abby makeup tutorial. I still cannot say her last name. Abby Bonneville. Bonneville? That sound, that flows easy, but I just feel like it's not pronounced that way. Okay, I do want to note that whenever you draw the fangs and add lip gloss, the pink or whatever color of your lip gloss actually starts to meld into the fangs. So if you wear this for a long night on Halloween or like to a party or something, try to avoid lip gloss, just a pencil for the fangs and a pencil for the color of your lips. Because anything glossy or smudgy is going to smudge all over them fangs. Alright, so I hope you enjoyed this makeup look. It was definitely a lot of fun. I love my white freckles. I think white freckles are just going to be so cool. And you can check the playlist. I'm going to list it down in the description block. Block? 
box. It could be a description block, who knows? But the playlist down there will link you to all of my Monster High makeup tutorials. And I hope everyone is having a terrorific, terror, terrorific, terrorific day. So thank you all so, so much, and I will see you in my next video. Bye. Need to get my picture out so I know what I'm doing. Poop. Now I'm gonna have to see what I need to re-record because my camera just shut off. Ugh.